All right, guys, so we got the legendary holographic Honda Accord here, the 2007 four-cylinder, and I want to show you what it sounds like when your power steering O-rings are bad. Um, I have a bad O-ring on mine, and we're going to replace it today, so let's go. All right, so the tools you're going to need for this job is going to be a 10-millimeter socket, an extension, your ratchet, a funnel, power steering fluid, Honda, of course, and your o-ring so i'll leave a link in the description to all the tools that i used if you purchase something thanks in advance because it helps the channel let's go all right so this is what it's going to sound like when your power steering o-ring is bad so let me get the wheel turning turn the wheel you hear that that's your o-ring that is bad so if your car is making that noise most likely your o-ring is bad and i'm gonna show you how to replace that so another key is that you got bubbles inside the reservoir see all those bubbles all those bubbles are another indicator that there's air getting into the system so i'm going to show you where the air is getting in on my actual vehicle so where the air is getting in is actually on this lower pressure hose right here so we're gonna go ahead, pop that off, and replace the O-ring. Let's go. All right, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is grab a rag, put that bad boy underneath right here because you are gonna lose some fluid. So once you do that, we're gonna go ahead and grab our handy dandy 10 millimeter with an extension, and uh, let's pop this off. We got our handy dandy 10 millimeter. Let's go ahead and pop this bad boy off. Shouldn't be too tight. put that to the side and then you're gonna pop that off so you are gonna lose some fluid but you see that o-ring right here that's what's causing it and if you can well you can't really see mine but mine's very brittle but it's also squared it's not circular you can't really tell from the video but it's squared on this side so we're gonna go ahead and get the new o-ring and be right back all right so i actually got these o-rings from a ac compressor kit that had extra o-rings in there so i saved them just in case you know you never know when you need o-rings and what's funny enough is that they fit perfectly so just grab your o-ring grab a little fluid on your finger Put that bad boy on there, and then we're gonna go ahead and put this O ring on. Boom. So now, shove that bad boy back in, just like that. Put our uh, 10 millimeter back on. We're gonna put everything back together. I'll be right back. All right, we got everything nice and buttoned up cleaned up the excess oil that was down there that we lost and uh, make sure before you start this that you have enough fluid power steering fluid in there before you start it. all right we're gonna add some of the fluid that we lost not too much just a little bit i didn't really lose too much that should be enough and now i'm gonna let you hear what it sounds like when that's replaced all right so we replaced the o-ring now i'm gonna let you hear what it sounds like go ahead turn the wheel no whining whatsoever and another indicator that you repaired it is those bubbles are all gone you'll have a few until it clears up and you purge it but as you drive all of those bubbles will clear up but no more winding noises. All right, guys, so that's how you replace the lower pressure hose O-ring on a power steering pump for a 2007 Honda Accord four-cylinder. And remember, if I can fix it, you can fix it. Thanks for watching.